Affordable housing is hard to come by for so many people right now, especially as the population grows here in North Texas. But one Dallas nonprofit is working to get families in homes with mortgages that they can manage. Our Steve Pickett profiling today the success and challenges of Builders of Hope. Alicia Hill, her first home and a mortgage she can afford. I am able to get a brand new uh, four bedroom, two bath home for well under 300,000. This Dallas employee of a local medical center could be the profile case for Dallas's painstakingly slow process to produce houses working class Dallas families can afford. There are service men and women who build and make our city thrive on a daily basis that need housing that we provide. James Armstrong leads Builders of Hope, a local community development operation building houses deemed affordable. Building houses for families earning less than $75,000 a year. The houses are typically 30% below Dallas's $320,000 median price tag and built in South and West Dallas neighborhoods. Through the years, Builders of Hope have built 500 homes Here's the challenge. The demand and the need is outpacing their ability to build these houses. You have a overwhelming demand for housing in general, um, but what we are not seeing is a supply of housing for the working class citizens of Dallas. Armstrong estimates 20,000 Dallas families need houses like this, but the combination of affordability and availability is still rare. Alicia Hill credits Builders of Hope with her journey to both inside her new home. In Dallas, Steve Pickett, CBS 11 News. Builders of Hope tells Steve and you that more funding from more partners certainly would help them do a better job of keeping up with the demand for affordable housing that Steve talked about. If you're interested in learning more about Builders of Hope and their program, getting on their waiting list maybe, check out the story. We've posted it for you on CBSDFW.com.